I'm excited about this game. I, I like a lot of scoring, so I'm a scorer, so I like scoring, and this team can do it in bunches. College Park split with Grand Rapids over the weekend, a 116-100. Another rookie from the Virginia Tech Hokies. Yeah, they're playing great. They're playing great. A little bit of depth on their side. They want to get out and run, try to wear them out. Pesnis hits the jumper in the paint. So, yeah, AP, he has a touch out there for a big guy. Averaging 9.6 rebounds or points per game, 4.8 rebounds per game. Hawks right now, they're a little bit loose with the ball. There's a lot of balls being tipped, stolen on the outlet passes. They have to Nine rebounds per game. Schofield banging bodies with Lumpkin, jump hook. Players that do all the right things. And Schofield can, can score. He can just flat out score. And that's Derrickson a, knocks wow. down the. And right here, Derrickson. Stop, stop, I can't hear you. Let's boy, he'll say he did it on purpose. Alex on top by a point. And this AP. right here is the matchup. This is the difference between the two players. So Derrickson can take you outside the three and knock it down. Pass inside and back around to the outside and good one. And then again, as I said, Sanjay slipped behind the screen. He was too to play at all. Didn't even try. No, it looks like he's going to have to have a sub. Charlie Brown. And players are playing a lot of minutes and injuries happen. Good one. And McCall gets the basket, and he comes up holding his knee. About 23 points per game, shooting at a 56% clip, so he's being efficient as well. McCall in the up and under by Ward for his first basket of the game. And so here, he actually didn't get a good set of the pick and roll, but Derrickson comes and sets the second screen. He rolls to And that's the thing about the go-go. They love the shots in the corner. They. He just made it look like there was maybe a more contact than there was, I think. Derrickson up and in. It's good to see him back out there. There's a lot of injuries going around. Everybody's nursing an injury, so I'm glad to see him back out on the court. Averaging 12 points per game out of Georgetown. Booth goes up against Derrickson and banked it in. Why wasn't it an and one situation? Derrickson inside. One player thought it was going to be a switch, and the other player thought they were going to stay on their man. Hudson misses from way downtown. Noah Allen with the three-pointer. It looks like they're just going to do a little iso with Charlie Brown at the top. Charlie. And Saved by the Skyhawks. Good one. Flips Offensive it over his rebound. shoulder to Seibert. And three nails the three. Seibert 32% behind the three-point line, averaging 11 a game. Gives Skyhawks a six-point lead, but not for long. Under a minute to play in the quarter. Inside, Robinson with a hard shot. Have good one off of the ball sometimes because he can score. He can shoot, he can penetrate, create shots for others. As Cat Barber lets it fly from the corner for a three. Him ends up with the loose ball in the corner. Again, what do we talk about? Offensive rebound, three-point shot. It's almost automatic. It's about every single play making a conscious effort to box out. As Brown. Charlie Brown does the... You didn't get to get the call. And not necessarily to make the shot, but to get the call. Barber to the paint and banks it in. It's only a matter of time before Cat Barber does exactly that. He can get to the cup at any time. And Robinson comes and does the same exact thing. Shooter as Matthews gets an open look at right there, you let him shoot it. Wow, got knocked down on the three-pointer, too, so he'll go to the line for a chance. Cardinal Sin fouled the the uh, the shooter. And to Brown's defense, down screens, double screens, coming off of a flare. Barber drives, beat his man Robinson on the baselines in the NBA because he's 6'5", he can't live in the post. He does, he absolutely does, and that's probably exactly... But the general managers will tell you, we don't need scores, we've got scores, we need guys to help the scores. Oh yeah, all these players in college as Nick Ward makes a big boy play down in the post. And here you see Schofield, as we talked about him trying to move into. We talked about him a lot, just uh, at playing at the guard position. He has 17 points on five of seven shooting, three for four, and right on cue, now 19. No, I'm not going to pronounce it correctly, but you got it. You're brave, because every time you attempt to say it. Derrickson well. puts it in. Sounded like that in my ears, but he was like, no, 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 you got it wrong. <laughs> yeah, because what you were saying and what he was hearing was not the same thing as AP. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> as AP shoots a little left-handed hook. Great cut. cut to the basket and Lumpkin 
with the left hand. And the Skyhawks all night have been so good at moving without the ball. They've gotten wide open three-point shot. Surprise, Dunham passed up that open three right there in transition. They kept trying to get it back to him. Allen on the drive and the finger roll. They did. It looked like his teammates wanted him to shoot it more than he did because they kept trying to pass it back to him like, no, man, you shoot it. Looking for Marcus Derrickson. He's already two points above his per-game average, and we're not yet at halftime. Oh, Booth yeah. on the drive and puts it in. At three guys right there. They block his shot. He hasn't gotten up yet. It's a five on four, and Hudson stuffs it. Five on the shot clock. Good one, pump fake. Drives, takes it, lays it in. This is the time where you make separation. You get good offense, you take good shots, and you go into the half with momentum. Brown in the corner. That's a two. Behind the line because he was back far enough that he could have easily had a three. There was nobody near him. Stop was shot by Seibert. Yeah, Booth went up there rather weak, and Seibert sent it out. Sent it right back to him. Nothing weak about that. Jalen Hudson sails in and slams it home. That's the second one he slammed home. So, again, transition defense, transition defense, transition defense. The Skyhawks have to get back. Booth, feet set, pumps it home. And that's what happens. Lob up top for AP. And right there, AP set a screen. The defender went up. Derrickson battles through a little hip check there, dumps it off for Goodwin, who puts five point lead for the go go. Grant launches the three, cans it. Jaron Grant with his first basket of the ball game after five misses. Justin Robinson also on assignment from the Wizards here along with Schofield. Guns to the corner and Matthews knocks down the three. Grant left open for three and he's going to can that. You can't leave him that wide open. He wants him to push it. They got a five on four right now. Good one. Rhythm three. There you go. Fatigued right now. They Even do. though they have the 11 point lead. They do, and that's the exact time. Woo! As Ward throws it down, that's the exact time that you do put your foot to the pedal. Collision at midcourt. Barber, wild shot, and it goes Woo! in! This is not, but I've seen him make it a lot of times great behind the back. The defender just wasn't straight. Like, so you might look at that and think it's a charge, but the defender didn't take the hit straight on. He got hit on the Argic. Right there is a little pistol action. Barber got a screen and fires. There you go. So if I was a Skyhawks, I'd look to put him in some pick and rolls, bring the ball up the court. Schofield working one-on-one -on -one against Ward and the dish. He was cutting to the basket. Now Ward working against Schofield, banging chest, and he puts it in. And that's a mismatch. On the rebound for the go-go. Grant goes right through traffic and Whoa. it looked like Ward tipped it in, didn't it? <laughs> it did look like that. Ward. And his face looked like he tipped it in. <laughs> the big fella has 12 points and eight rebounds tonight. Barber drops it for Ward. Look at the spin move by Nick. Woo! The pace sure picked up in the last minute. Brown contact. That's a very graceful move for a 6'9 man. Goodwood lobs it up. And the Go-Go tried to go back to that pick and roll with AP because it's been good to him, but now the Skyhawks have sucked in and helped on defense. And half the Skyhawks have to make free throws. Hudson goes right through the defense. He's got 10. Good one, bomb time. There you go, 44 to play in the quarter. Allen, nice cut to the basket, and he got the uh, Skyhawks defense sucked into the baseline. McCall is hurt on the other end for the Skyhawks. He's slow getting down the floor. Ooh. Barber, nifty move, and buried the jumper. He buried the jumper, broke a couple ankles along the way. Coach Gillespie called that timeout when they fell behind 75-61, but it has been the Skyhawks' tempo that has brought them back. Another chance. Booth swiped away. Good one at half court. AP gets it back after setting the screen, fumbled it away, and Ward picks up the trash. It's, that, it's still the same concept, wow. the pick and roll, woo, with <laughs> AP. Barber was moving. Matthews is on the court, so his defender needs to keep a close eye on him, not help as much as he typically would. AP with the soft hook. Ward are going head-to-head -head every single play. 
Brown, shot, put, shot. Schofield, banging. Put it in on assignment from the Washington Wizards. Gonna launch a three and hit it. No problem with the Admirals offense. 24 points on four three-pointers tonight. Barber fired to Ward, wasn't ready for it. And McCall scoops it in. Schofield again. Wow. McCall snags it. That's that transition to Ahead for Brown. Three. What? Look at Beautiful. that. What they did it was they pushed the ball in transition, and they were helping on defense and got stops. Barber right in there in the paint. They used it in November. I'm here for Christmas all the time. Schofield smoking. <laughs> Grant on the drive. That said, they haven't had a two-game losing streak either, so they, they just haven't been a streaky team. They'd like to be a streaky team in the right direction. Still got to get the win here tonight. It's a five-point lead. Barber spin moves right into Schofield. Then Schofield dropped off him and left him with an easy basket. They have Cat Barber bringing the ball up the court. Again, it gives Brandon some rest. It also has him coming off of the screens as the scorer. Derrickson in the paint, stuck it in. Dribble. Approaching the four-minute mark. Booth in traffic, got the roll. Probably cause a fuss by a lot of players. Grant beats the press, then Whoa. got a shot blocked by Cat Barber. Hudson hangs in the air. Nice hesitation move. Under three to play. Seven on the shot clock. McCall drives. Crossover. Step through. Basket. And that's the thing about Pro. So tip your hat to him. He's clearly in pain. He's clearly hurting. As I love watching Cat Barber play. Playing. Keep away for a second. But now they get the ball to Goodwin. Goodwin hangs in the air and drops it in. That's Brandon Goodwin. Well, it looked like Schofield was the first option, so they had him running off the baseline screen. If he had the look, they were going to let him get it. Cat Barber is on fire. What is that that the fans are chanting? The fans want somebody in the game. Uh-oh. McCall lays it in. Second place in the Southeast Division. They will, and they're playing good basketball right now. They've been trading every other game with a win as Derrickson knocks down the three. 21 and 11 for Derrickson tonight. Trash basket there for Booth. A team evenly matched at six and six. That's a huge win for the Skyhawks. Yeah, evens up the season series two with two more games to go between the two Southeast Division opponents.